Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back to the channel. And if it's your first time tuning in, welcome to All Things Delicious. Today on Brave Belly, I'm filming at the Bucky's gas station. That's right, America's most amazing gas station. I absolutely love Bucky's. They have literally over 150 gas pumps and they have the most amazing restrooms. Super clean, lots of stalls. I mean, the place is phenomenal. It's literally like a Walmart of gas stations. So if you guys never seen a Bucky's, I do suggest when you get a chance, you have to make a pit stop and try out all their amazing foods. Without further ado, we're gonna get right into it. Today, I got their double XL big bucking brisket sandwich, double XL chopped beef. And the cool part about the store is when you're walking around, they'll yell, fresh biscuit on the board and slap on a big old fresh brisket you know freshly cut right in front of you so it definitely looks appealing they, they have so many versions of this sandwich they have like the chopped the sliced and then they have turkey which i do have to show for you guys i bought a barbecue turkey sandwich that i will be opening up and eating as well they have i, I mean it's endless amounts of foods that they have like the bucky's brand whether it's all different types of beef jerkies and chips and uh, all different types of snacks and chocolates and and they make like their own different nuts as you know as far as like covered in cinnamon and sugars but let's get right into their double XL brisket all right so check it out looks all definitely thick I do have to say though this is definitely not cheap 12.99 for this brisket would you believe that? I mean, when I saw the price, I was just, I actually, I'll be honest, I didn't even look at the price. I just swiped the plastic, you know? Buy now, cry later, basically. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna just munch right into that. Look how nice it is, though. Definitely beefy. All right, first bite going down. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Tastes very fresh. Barbecue flavor, you know, absolutely delicious. Very like rich and fresh. Literally like you're at a barbecue joint. Meanwhile, just a gas station. God, I love America. Not like being on the open road. It gives you a real sense of freedom. You know, like a, a credit card or a debit card filled with cash, a full tank of gas in a roomy, comfortable truck, hitting that road, hitting that highway. I love it. And then you got that Bucky's, you know, you pull over for a pit stop. Mmm, phenomenal. I mean, look at that. They don't skimp on it. You do pay for it, though. I guess this is one of them things where you definitely could say you pay for what you get. Because this tastes expensive. Mm. Phenomenal. We're going to just jump right into the turkey barbecue sandwich. When I saw that, I was like, oh, I got to give that one a try, too. You know, complete contrast. Usually, I don't really think of turkey when I think of barbecue barbecue turkey sandwich look at that and this one what's the price of this one $8.99 that ain't cheap all right this one I'm gonna completely unwrap because it's not as messy so you guys can get the full so look at look how thickly cut that turkey breast is I mean big old thick cut all right and it's very very you know no frills just big old slice of turkey breast and barbecue sauce for $8.99 I mean but that's a lot of meat you know what I'm saying so you'll definitely be full all right look at this big old corner first bite going in mmm wow that's so moist that bite had like this crispness to it wow very good honestly I would say I actually like this sandwich more than the than the brisket. Mmm. 
because it's not like drowning in sauce you actually get like a moist turkey flavor like barbecue so there's like this kind of like burst when you when you're chewing it it's absolutely delicious mm. wow definitely the turkey barbecue sandwich It's top shelf. Ama absolutely amazing. Look, no pickle, no anything, and just so good. The bread is so solid. Like, this is perfect for the road. It's not even, you know, you don't have all these crazy ingredients that'll make the sandwich fall apart. Really simple for the for the car, for the road. I love it. Mmm. Good old Americana. All right. Let's see what else we got. All right. I'm going to wash it down with some of this sprite i've never seen this sprite it's a tropical mix this is my first time trying it so i'm looking forward to it excited about i love trying new things this is just one example let's see definitely fruity It's just like a fruity Sprite. Not my favorite. I do prefer the lemon flavor way more. This kind of reminds me of like those trendy, you know, white claws and stuff like that. Minus the alcohol. Not my favorite. All right. I have more guys. All right. Check this out. So I also got a Bucky's hot apple pie. I don't see the price on this one. Let me see. I might have ripped it. Apple pie. $1.99. So two bucks for an apple pie. Which is double the price of Mickey D's. Let's see if it competes. It's completely different. And a lot smaller. It's more like a... Kind of like a strudel almost. Like a wrap. Check that out. Like it's folded over. It's got a lot of brown sugar on one side, like a cinnamon. It smells like cinnamon. And this one, not as much. Okay, we're gonna just check it out. Mmm. Wow. Really delicious. This tastes more like actual pie. This doesn't taste like a like a fast food gas station uh, dessert. Mmm. Mm, there goes the filling. Just like Mickey D's. But the outer layer, it doesn't have crunch to it as much. It's a lot softer. Like a pie would be very good. Mmm. All right. Guys, check this out. Milk, milk, chocolate, caramel with sea salt. Like I said, they literally have endless options of like their own snacks. Literally, like nuts. They have like endless amounts of different types of jerkies, which I have had before, and it's phenomenal. Just like so much actual like Bucky's brand stuff. Not to mention T-shirts and souvenirs and coasters and. All that type of stuff. Which is super cool, you know? It's very on brand and I love Bucky's for that. All right? Caramel sea salt going down. These are two for a dollar. I think 59 cents each or two for a dollar. Very good. Mm, hits the spot. I did have a chocolate craving while I was driving because I spent a couple of days in Colorado and a couple of days in Tennessee. I did have a lot of barbecue foods, so I was just in the mood for chocolate, and that definitely hits the spot. And now check this out, beaver nuggets covered in white fudge, all right? Uh, we've taken our beloved beaver nuggets and upped the ante by covering them in smooth white chocolate. So basically, there's also a lot of like, 
snacks called um, beaver nuggets, which is, I believe they're like some kind of corn snacks. They look like cheese curds. So and they're like dense and delicious and then they have them like in different versions, you know, so it's like its own thing. Like, you know, only at Bucky's, their own uh, beaver nuggets is what they call them. And they'll have them either covered in chocolate or like plain or with like cinnamon, all different versions. So it's like, no, not just chips, you know, also beaver nuggets. It's, I, I mean, absolutely adore the place. You, you, I recommend you guys check it out. All right, let's see what these are about. dive right into it mmm so good it's like a hard fried donut it's like a crunchy donut mmm and the the actual inside part I believe they use corn oh the nuggets is brown sugar cornmeal corn syrup vegetable oil so it's like a you know like a <clears throat> A cheese doodle if you will but it's made out of corn and it's like denser that's the best way I could describe it they're absolutely phenomenal because they're salty and sweet with that milk um, with that white chocolate my favorite chocolate mm. oh yeah so bomb guys I've been blessed with a phenomenal experience on this road trip like I said earlier, I love road trips, and this one was absolutely amazing. I, <clears throat> excuse me, I've been lucky enough that um, it all went without a hitch. I had a phenomenal time, you know, um, so far so good, knock on wood. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm almost home, and I definitely miss home. Can't wait to get back and film some more videos for you guys. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, cheers.